Hello, and welcome back to another edition of The Sticky Show. My name is Stephen Green. My name is Nikki Limo Green. And the, today, we have a very important episode. Good today. We're going to be very seriously analyzing whiskey tastings. Whiskey. whiskey is a serious liquor. American whiskey and European whiskey is a serious thing. It's about as serious, serious as it gets. It takes a serious man with a gravelly voice. Yes. Gravelly posture. I'm just here for decoration. You gotta wear steel-toed boots. You gotta have something slow cooking in the kitchen you gotta be ready to drink some <laughs> whiskey are you ready nick couldn't be more ready so we did a video a couple weeks ago called uh blind tequila taste test or something like that where we tasted different tequilas blindfolded and we were able to distinguish the difference between a cheap tequila versus an expensive tequila we're doing the same thing today however plot twist we don't know anything about whiskey can we still differentiate between an expensive and a cheap whiskey i don't know i don't know that's what we're gonna both find out all of us as a family. Is it worth your dollar? This blindfold is on very tight and Same. I'm, I'm low-key upset because I spent a lot of time on my eye makeup this morning. Oh, that is high-key But it's, it's okay. I'll do it for the whiskey. Here's your shot glasses. All right. Thank you. And they're little shots, right? We don't, we don't want to get fucked. I want to get fucked. Well, I'm ready to get blasted. Here's the thing about whiskey dick. It doesn't work. True. Sad for your wife. All right, whiskey number one. So we're going to tell you one, if we like it and how it tastes, and two, if we can tell if it's cheap or expensive. Yes? 100%. Is this worth your money? Yep. Is this worth your time? Is this worth your liver declining? Yep. Ready? Find out right now. It smells good. It smells bomb. I like it so far. Well bodied, nice composure. Mm. Oh, mm. very smooth. That's good. That's this is, really good. This is very good. I was able to swish it around my mouth and then take a shot of it and no problem. Usually when a shot of whiskey is bought for me at a bar, usually it's in a group of drunk people that are like, oh, a shot of whiskey for everybody. You're doing it. You're doing it. And I have it and it burns my freaking body. Yes. But this was great. I'm going to go expensive. And if it's not expensive, you know what? This whiskey, is the one you need to know your value. I'm because gonna... you are a goddamn queen. I'm good. Wow, that was that's wow. a really strong wow. endorsement. I'm yeah. gonna say that this is not sponsored. I'm gonna say this is Maker's Mark. Maker's Mark. Yep, and it's very very good. So I used to be at Maker Studios, and everyone thought it was funny to give everybody Maker's Mark there. So I think this is Maker's Mark, but I could be dead wrong, obviously. I'm gonna go higher end. I'm gonna go Blue Label. <laughs> but what? I have, I have no comparison though. You think this is Blue Label? This is just better no. than Jack Daniels. This is not Blue Label, bro. This is better than Jack Daniels. This is not Blue Label. Okay, I've never had Blue Label. Oh, you haven't? No. Oh. I've never had, uh, I don't drink whiskey. Ever. Wait, didn't you have a sip with me the other night? I honestly can't differentiate that I between see. a sip of Jack Daniels. I, I need them side by side. So this being the first yeah. one, I have nothing to compare to other than to tell you that it tastes pretty smooth. So it's, it's good. No, you're right. It's very what, good. Wait, is Maker's Mark mid level or is it cheap? Cheap. It's, it's cheap. It's cheap. Yeah. Oh, okay. What about a black black label? Is that more? Black uh, label's cheaper. Mid range. Oh, is it is it mid range? I'm gonna go black label then. You think it's black label? I'm gonna go black label. Straight up. Yeah. If I don't taste a smoother whiskey in this, then I have to recant and say blue label again. Could be, it could be blue label? It, it, what? Yeah. You were so adamant about it not being blue label. Yeah, it could be though. It could be. See, I need some th something to compare to. I'm gonna say that this is. I'm such a not whiskey guy, but I'm gonna say that this is. Baker's Mark, I'm standing with it. Okay. Next whiskey, Nate. I forgot that there was a bullet bourbon in here. Oh, right. There's bullets. Yeah, so that might have been bullet. Because that oh, was a pretty good right. one. Oh, you're right. That was bullet. So the first one might have been bullet. Oh, yeah, you're right. That was fucking bullet, dude. Because it was really good. It was very good. Okay, so we both are agreeing that that was bullet. I agree that was bullet. Okay, we're going to say that it was bullet. I forgot that bullet was in the on, on the... I know, I was trying to think docket. of, so I know what what whiskeys Nate bought, we just don't know which ones are in front yes. of us. Yeah. I think you're right, I think that was bullet. Hell yeah, you think I was right? Oh I my do. god. I think you're right. Yeah, I just came into my mind. Okay, okay. Okay. This one smells stronger. Yeah, you can definitely smell the alcohol Very content strong. more, Very which strong. means it's probably cheaper, I'm gonna guess. Or maybe it's more expensive, I don't know anything. Oh, mm. that's smooth as fuck. Mm. Mm. Smooth as balls, bro. Maybe that one's bullet. <laughs> we have so much integrity. In this one choices. tastes more caramely. Can I say that? Would oh, you agree with that? It tastes like- You're like, absolutely right. When I swish it around, it tastes like caramel corn. It's if caramel popcorn was drenched in alcohol, this would be it. I think you're right. Which is a characteristic of- Of what? 
What when? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just telling you how I feel. It's like being one of those dating shows where you can't see the person and you just have to go by their personality to just like, you don't know what they who what their name is or who they look like or yep. whatever. So that's what I'm going off of his personality here. And this one's a very caramel personality. Okay, the last one, I'm gonna go back to say Black Label. This one, I'm gonna say Bullet. What the fuck? Yeah, I don't care. Because I think that bourbon might be more caramely. <laughs> so the last one I guess was Bullet, right? Yeah. I'm gonna say that this one is um, Johnny Walker Black. Okay, I'm opposite. Okay. Okay, so the last one I think is Black and this one I think is Bullet. All right. Okay. Ballsy. All right. Yep. Got it. Got it. Got it. Next. Whiskey number three. Okay. Okay. okay, I can smell it. Ooh, wow, okay, wow. Oh fuck, this is Johnny Walker Blue, baby. Motherfucking excellent. Wow. Motherfucking perfucking perfection, bro. You can really taste the- Yep, the price. Agedness, for that reason. That is fucking excellent, like, by God. It's smoky. Like it it's is smoky, it is more smooth. Smoke. It's like an aged gentleman. Dude, it's, it's like, I don't know, man. If, if you could just like blend a library book, it tastes like that. And I know that that sounds like that it sounds wouldn't taste disgusting. good. That's but disgusting. that's exactly what it tastes like. I'm not even huh. kidding you. Like, you know how you open a crack, open like a fucking textbook, and you smell it, and it smells like that shit, and you're like, oh, it smells good. Wow, so you, if you want to drink a textbook, if you want to drink your homework, then go, go for this one. Johnny Walker Blue every time. Pay a $300 premium. $300 a bottle, baby. This one was not $300, but. This was more tiny, expensive, even more expensive. To be honest, so far, I like the first one the best. What? I don't know. I think because I just don't like a smoky flavor. It's very smooth, and but it's I don't like the smoky flavor so much. Okay, that makes sense. Here's the thing. If there's something smoother, I will change my answer okay. to that, but this is the smoothest yet by far. Do you agree with that? I would say this is the smokiest and aged by yes, far. Yes, this is excellent but I, shit. Um, I don't know. I thought they were all pretty smooth. Hang on, Steve. Can I taste yours real quick? Yeah. I may have made a mistake. You want some of that blue label, baby? Okay, I didn't make a mistake. You did? Oh. I put the wrong bottle down in front of you. Okay, okay. Nate. Wow. Made a mistake. Wait, is mine the same as this? Yeah, they're, they're all the same. I just grabbed the wrong bottle. You got all the right, wrong bottle. all right, got it. So. So Nate has made an error, a boo boo. It wasn't our fault. Not and my it, fault. And, and I don't even know what was changed. What we are describing is this bottle. It'd be pretty funny if you were saying that and it was like a, a Jack one. Daniels or Jim Beam bottle great. in front of you. That would be great. <laughs> so whatever we, are, we were describing is about this bottle. Can I just say that Nate could have stood there and laughed at our idiocy? Yeah. But instead he had the fucking ball, it's the true. fucking integrity. Nate to saved say, this video. To say, wait saved a minute. This. Something ain't right here. Yeah. So he's like, wait a minute, they both think it's dope and Nikki's not clowning on Steve, so he's not clowning on Nikki. <laughs> I'm gonna fix this mistake. <laughs> Nate's the real fucking hero of this video. Yeah, dude, I'm, I don't know, man. Like I said, if there's a smoother one we have after this, I will say that that's the we blue one, but this is the blue one. This is the blue one. Uh, okay, I'll go blue just because Steve said it and he <sighs> drinks a lot of whiskey. I think that you just made an excellent decision. I will bet on my husband's Whiskey, oh, thank you. That's actually tongue. sweet. Usually you break my balls all the time, but that was very sweet. Well, the thing is you drank in so many bottles of whiskey. Yeah, thank and, you. And wrecked Aww. your body so much in your liver, in Aww. your liver part of your body. Baby. That I trust you. What a sweetie. I know. Don't say sweet things. I know. Your dick better work late. <laughs> it's a party. I'm very oh, buzzed. Part. I'm buzzed. <laughs> this is the turtle one. I feel it. What is a turtle? There's a we bought a shot glass that had a turtle on it from when we went to Hawaii. Oh yeah, that, and that was it. We saw a sea turtle came up to us, and it was a very romantic moment. It and was. so then we bought a shot glass with a turtle on yeah. it, so we will always remember. But Steve doesn't remember. For the record, because I feel like you need a win. That is the turtle shot glass. Hell yeah! Nate, you're not supposed to tell her this is oh, fucking shit. turtle shot glass. Well, in there, he told cheating. us that because we need a win. Because obviously we've been way off. Oh, like, shit. What, what am I lying about? Right, am right, I right. Am I lying about that's a turtle shot glass or that oh. you guys needed a win? Oh, I oh, think you're shit. lying about that we need, that this is, the, I feel like you're lying about that we needed a Wait, you're not lying about either thing. No, he's saying <laughs> that we've been off. Yeah, exactly. That's what I'm yeah. saying. Or am I? Both. Oh my God. Yeah. Okay. And for the record, this is the bottle that I switched it out with last time by mistake, and 
Yeah. Okay, this is no. I remember this one. Oh! This is Maker's Mark, bro. This is Jack Daniels. This is fucking Maker's Mark. This is I used to drink this shit at no, Maker's Mark. No, this Studios. is Maker's Mark. This, this is, is Maker's Maker. Mark for Wait, sure. Wait, this is Jack Daniels. This is Maker's no, Mark. No, no, no. Jack no, this is Maker's Mark for sure. I drank this enough. Yeah, it's Maker's Mark. Out of Mark. pity and hate and self-hate. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I would go with Maker's Mark. Wow, man. It just tastes like paint. Like, it really has that paint. It doesn't taste like paint. It's painty. It tastes, um, I don't mind it. It's just, okay, you know that smoky, leathery taste that we were describing earlier? Yeah. It's like that, but on fire. Right. So that doesn't sound good, does it? No, but that's not what paint tastes like. Oh, I've never had paint, but like. Well, you smell paint. paint. Right, but I feel like I would prefer this over paint. I, I agree. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, I agree with that. Okay. But I will say that so. if you're the closest thing to a human being able to consume paint, this is it. Maker's Mark, 100%. Disagree. Popov's vodka. Try that. Oh, fuck. You're right. Thank you. Actually, wait. Popov's is not um, terrible. Are you serious? Get yeah. out of this house. No, no, no Actually, Get it's not terrible. House. I will say it's not what terrible. What the fuck is wrong with your taste buds? I, no, honestly. Okay, so He doesn't I, give you heartburn as fuck? So I hosted this show for Morgan uh, Spurlock a couple Ooh, years ago. Name where we, drop yeah, a little while on uh, Yeah, you ever heard of them? Super size me, you ever heard of them? Thank you. So they had me try a bunch of different alcohols that were um, considered like below to blow shelf or whatever the fuck. And Pop-Off was one of the better ones Ew. of the vodkas. Honestly, just saying. Anyway. Disagree. This is making me <laughs> wrong. <laughs> All right. No doubt in my mind. I, d I agree with that. But if I'm wrong, whatever. The, so far, the not, only one. So far, the only ones we've disagreed on are the first two, where I say the first one was black, and then the second one was bullet, and you have it reversed. Yeah, we're on the same yeah. page. Okay, cool. This is the last one. Last one. Ooh. Oh shit! So there's only one left. This is the last one. This is it, baby. What have we not guessed yet? I think only Jack Daniels is left that we haven't guessed. Mm. I don't like this one. I don't like this one. I don't like it. Oh yeah, that's Jack Daniels. Whatever it is, I don't like it. No, you nailed it, Nikki. Okay, That's Jack Daniels' Daniels mother as a motherfucker, bro. It's very uh, smoky, though. Yeah? Is it? Which is kind of the thing about Johnny Walker Black, Black I think. That's it's true, though. Good. I never have had a shot of Jack Daniels. It wasn't smoky. Yeah, it's not smoky, man. That's what I'm saying. This is way smoky. Oh, this is like a, just fucking a smoke injection. I, whatever. I don't like it. This is so probably gonna... Johnny Walker Black, but it, I could be wrong. It could be Maker's Mark, too. But I think it's Johnny Walker Black. If I have to guess. Man. See, Thank maybe I should have well. tasted Johnny Walker's in general because before doing this video because I didn't know about the smoky element. To I like smoky, by the way, but this is not uh, very... It's not very right. tasty. With that being said, then I would change this to Johnny Walker Black. And then I would have to change my first one to... Damn, but then would I have to change my first one to I Jack know. Daniels? Yeah, yeah. Maybe we both should. Honestly, if that's Jack Daniels, if the first one was Jack Daniels, you should spend your money on that. Yeah, that's true. If you're not like a like whiskey connoisseur that yeah. you like, you're like, very I don't drink about. Jack. Uh -huh. Right, right. Uh -huh. hmm. Oh, cool, dude. All right, well. Yeah, I guess you like... Fucking burning three bills every time you want a glass of whiskey, then, because like that's the only thing. Some people you can that's, do that is that some people that they do like to spend their money on eliteness. That's why I feel about Corvette drivers. I'm like, it's not that great. So like, I this... fucking love Corvette. Do you? Yeah. I I'll say the new ones better, but the old ones that my uncles used to drive, I'm like, this shit is weak, bro. Uh, Barbie drove one, so. Who did? Barbie. You know her? Yeah, she drove one of the one of the older ones, the hot one. But I still think Corvette's kind of whatever. You know, you drive a mini. I drive a hot mini though, a hot one. Okay, so our final answers would have to be I these think are from this two assholes that don't know anything about Walker whiskey. Black, Johnny Walker Black. We're gonna go. Number one was uh, Bullet. Jack. I think Bullet. Number one, Bullet. Because between one and two, I, like, what's more caramely? That's what I'd have to know. Yeah. Is yeah, Jack Daniels true. more caramely than Bullet? Because then I would say, yeah. I think it is. Okay, then I would say number one, Bullet. But I don't know anything about whiskey, so maybe well, I'm What wrong. the fuck? I then, just know that Smokey is Johnny Walker Black's thing. Okay, but what about caramely? I'm gonna go number one, Jack Daniels. Number two, Bullet. Number three, Blue Label, and then number four, Maker's Mark, and number five, Black Label. I'm with you in closeness. I think number one is Bullet. Bullet. I think that number two was Jack Daniels. I think that number three was obviously Blue Label. I think number four, Maker's Mark, and then this is Johnny Walker Black. You know what's interesting is I have taken so many shots of Jack Daniels, but I think <laughs> I just took them too fast and didn't like savor them. And yeah. so they always just felt burning to me. That's why I don't do shots really, um, unless it's cheaper shit. Listen, by the time I'm doing shots, I'm already so drunk I don't say no. Good point. Well, how do we do, Nate? How do we do, Nate? Come in and tell can us we, how we do. Can we, we unblindfold now? Yeah, yeah, totally. Oh, 
because you guys. Oh wow, it's bright. It was black. Nailed it. Who won the the one two debate? So the first one was Bullet. Ah, uh, you got see. And the second one was Jack. I but, said that. I said that. Yes, yeah, so you got them all right. I got them all right. Hey, I you helped you right. get it. I helped you get it right. I was wrong because I was like in the second tasting. I was like, oh, I forgot about Bullet. You did. I forgot about Bullet too. Um, so Steve won this one. Wow! Yeah. So about I'm, time. I didn't just win. I was undefeated. What? Did I get anything wrong? No, yeah, you got. Oh, because of tequila. I got 100. Oh, because of tequila. Oh, and tequila. Because of tequila. I see. I'm undefeated, dude. That's undefeated. pretty good. That is pretty good. For Sticky Show? You drink a lot. That's pretty good. You hey, drink you a go. lot. I knew nothing about whiskey before this. I didn't even know that, that we got mostly bourbons and then we have some scotches. What is the difference? I don't know. Yeah, what is Oh, yeah, which. Which one's our the scotches? Difference. Black label and blue. Oh, so the smokiness. Yes. Yeah, that's just the scotch thing. I don't like I don't like the smoky. Oh, you don't like it at all? I didn't like those. Have you had mezcal before? Ooh. Yes, that's I don't like it. I, I like don't like shit. mezcal. Okay, so you guys remember call back to the Game of Thrones whiskey drinking. Which uh <laughs> hey hey, how you doing on those seasons of Game of Thrones? Right. I'm doing really good, guys. Steve? We didn't put a time time on it, thank God. I'm on it. I'm working on it. But if you remember, that's pretty much what it tasted like. It did. Oh, it was really, really close. Oh, I forgot close. about that. It was very close. To I need a whiskey sour for mine. Oh, you did, didn't you? I did. I so I did that. not drink it like that. Well, there you go. Oh, I you go. I personally think the first so the first one was Bullet. That was my favorite out of all of them. Yeah. Um, I good. think. You Wait, out of Johnny Walker Blue too? Yeah, because I don't like the smoky. I don't. I don't oh, like I it. it. I mean, if you're a whiskey drinker, if you like smoky, if you like mezcals, then yeah, for sure, Johnny Walker Blue had the smoky and it was smooth. So I get why people would pay more if they like that type of flavor. I don't like that type of flavor. Uh, number one was my favorite by far, and that was Bullet. Wow. Um, Bullet's very good. Bullet's good. Bullet's very good. I will say, Johnny Walker Blue, by far the best. Um, but Bullet, very a very close second. I'm a little disappointed we didn't have Wood for Reserve, which is one of my favorites. Not sponsored. Not sponsored. Uh, but if anyone wants to sponsor us, uh, I enjoyed most of these whiskeys. We had Bullet Bourbon at our wedding. And there was just a shot of Bullet Bourbon was one of our drinks on the menu, and it was called Ben Limo's Tears after seeing the wedding bill. Her dad, Ben Limo. My yeah. dad. Okay. Yeah. All right, I hope you enjoyed this video. Let us know if you liked it or whatever. If you like what, what your favorite type of whiskey is, we would love to know. We would love to try it. Um, and what do you want to see next? Subscribe so you don't miss any of this, and we will see you next time. Don't forget to go like our podcast because that helps oh, yeah, out a lot. Oh, yeah, it comes out today. Yeah, it comes out today. Go, go check it out. Listen and rate us because it helps out so much. You have no idea. It helps out like big time. But he said. <laughs>